You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by NewTek, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. I always enjoy that music. It's so good. Good music. I, I so like to dance during <laughs> the commercial breaks. <laughs> Are you going to dance with me? Uh, I could dance you with you. You and your hot yoga plant uh, dance? Possibly. I'm not going to let that possibly. go. Welcome to the Cali and <laughs> Kevin show. Right. Or otherwise known as CES Live. Uh, thank you guys so much for joining us. I'm Cali Lewis. That's Kevin. I can't stop laughing. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to stop laughing. Because we got right. something exciting to do today. We do, actually. Um, they're actually talking about in the chat room uh, that uh, I, I go to the gym quite a bit. I'm into fitness. What can I say? We have a fitness company with us, a health, I would say more health uh, and you know, fitness wellness. company, a wellness right. company. We have Mark and Rosario from Cardio. That's right. Hi, Thanks, for Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us. This looks <laughs> awesome. I see toys and I get really excited. Yes, exactly. Well, we got two toys here. We have a, um, we're about digital health and uh, yes. not only, you know, fitness tracking, but also wellness and health tracking. So our first product here is the Quadio Arm. Um, as you can see, it's, this is actually a blood pressure monitor, even though it you know, doesn't even look like a medical device. Uh, and then we have the Quadio Core, it is an ECG monitor. So this actually tracks uh, your ECG uh, um, physical activity your body temperature and galvanic skin response. So it's got okay. to be sweating. Let's back up a little bit. Let's take Good one idea. at a time. Yeah. Okay, so first of all, we have the blood pressure monitor. Yeah. Um, actually, let's back up even further because Kevin was about to ask yeah. you and, and we didn't want to do that before we started. Tell us about Quardio. Where you know where are you guys from? Where the name come from? I really sure. like saying it. So. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds fancy, right? It sounds Quardio. amazingly fancy. Uh, in, his, in your accent, it sounds even better. So, well, originally, we, both of us were Italian, okay. right? And uh, I guess as you can see from our product, we put also a lot of attention to design yes, I can and tell. also user experience. So, where the Quardio name comes from, uh, you know, there are a lot of uh, fitness tracker out there that are very cool and exciting to use. Uh, but you know they track your steps, how much you run, how much you cycle. Yeah. And the other side of the spectrum, you have a medical devices that are very important. They are you know provide you a great help, you know helping your doctors and yourself taking care of your health. But they are not always that easy to use or yeah. friendly to use. And what Quadio, what Quadio has as a mission is create medical devices that are also great to use every day that you can feel. Uh, confident with having around you all the time. So, so the it, target market is people like us, price points are for people like us. Yes, absolutely. People that want to get, take care of their own health or uh, of the health of peop people that are close to them, you know, maybe family member or close friends. Uh, and uh, so all our products are designed not to look like medical devices. And likewise, in our name, there is a little bit of an echo of uh, you know, something medical, but it's, you know, it's not quite there. It's, uh, it's right. got something uh, fancy about it. And yeah. so that's where the name comes from. I love it. All right, let's see what this, uh, blood, this uh, blood pressure monitor Blood is pressure monitor, it yeah. I'll show you the quadrant arm first. About. So you open it like so, and nice. then you fit wow. it on your upper arm. And you're ready to go. Oh, so, so like he can do it himself. You're gonna, Absolutely. That's amazing. So I'm going to launch the app, it's on the iPhone. The device switches itself on automatically when you open it and then when turns you open itself, the app. When you open the device. Oh, okay. And close it, uh, turns itself off when you close it. The green, big green button is, is uh, indicating that I'm ready to do measurements. That so looks I, pretty intuitive. I, I don't yeah. know how you would not know how to use that. So I'll just press the button here and start the measurement. Okay. And now does that, that cuff doesn't have to inflate though, right? It will inflate it actually, will inflate. Oh, yes. Okay. It wirelessly connects with the Bluetooth 4.0 uh, and sends a signal. So the measurement is sent wirelessly from the Quadio arm to my iPhone in this case. And from here, it's going to go to our cloud where we'll make it available to whoever I want. So it'll be my doctor or my wife or my you know father if he wants to look up my data as well. So uh, speaking of which, you know, uh, 
if I want information sent to not only my family but also my doctor, like I, I see a future with medical technology where we don't necessarily have to go to the doctor in order to get checkups, right? You could use a device like this and have that information sent to your doctor. He could prescribe whatever he needs to prescribe back to you without ever having to go wait in a line and waste a whole bunch of time. Is this sort of the first steps towards that? Definitely, definitely. This is the first step towards that uh, with cardio arm and the cardio core together. Uh, all the information are transferred to a central location and from that central location uh, the doctor can, uh, can access that information and therefore doctor can uh, continuously, uh, you are continuously monitored and therefore mm -hmm. doctor can access to that information at any time. That's fantastic. So my measurement is done oh. here. So this is a CS is pretty high pressure here. Yes, it is. So <laughs> you can see this is my chart. It's looking and the the CS going line. full 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 throttle here oh, with wow. my blood pressure. Uh, so so that chart I, I can't quite see. It's indicating it, it does it uh, how high my blood pressure is compared to standard values. Obviously, I love to talk okay. to my doctor. Uh, and my doctor will tell me what should be my correct values. I can add an annotation. So I'm gonna have in. I'm feeling great today. I can add any annotation I like here, and that's all recorded. And it's going to be in my history now, where I have all my measurements. And uh, I can set reminders. Very and also, nice. I can access, I'm going to show you in a second. So, I'm tracking here my father's blood pressure. Oh. So, I can see here if he's measuring wow. his blood pressure and how his measurements look like. Christmas hey. presents for everybody in the family. Exactly. Right. I, gotta, I don't trust my dad, right? <laughs> I'm like, I tell him, I'm like, Dad, you know, stop at three eggs for breakfast. And he's like, 26. Well, you know, it's, it always feels better, you know, to have people around you that supports you and encourage yeah. you yeah. and, uh, you know, help you keep up in, uh, you know, better shape. So on the gadget side here, a couple of questions. So one, you know, this guy, obviously it has some sort of battery pack in it. It's self-powered. How are you, you know, how, how long does that last for? Is it charged through micro USB uh, we, or what kind of no, thing? No, we use a standard uh, battery. Uh, and it lasts for uh, more than a year of measurements. Wow! Yeah. Oh. So, four AAA batteries, yeah. so for, oh, with average okay. usage, it lasts yeah. for a year. Wow, that is yeah. impressive. So, so that's really convenient then. That's, that's, I was thinking, you know, charge it every week, and I was getting a little scared that it might yeah. you know, like, That your dad would it. not well, use exactly. it, yeah. Um, and then API, are you working on, do you have any kind of API so you can let, you know, software developers working on other health apps pull in the data from you guys? So, uh, so in terms of, in terms of uh, API to access our platform, we are, uh, you know, we need to comply with HIPAA and other s uh, standards for security of data. Okay. So we have an API that we open selectively to uh, partners, so a selective uh, uh, services and, and, and providers can access our data. Okay, okay, great. And what's the cost on this one? So this one will be available for retail for $99 as soon as uh, we get the FDA clearance. You know, that's a really good that's price because uh, if you think about having to go to the doctor all the time and, and get this information and then being able to share it, that, that's great. Oh, that's incredibly, like, that's very affordable. And when do you expect that to come to market so, after approval? So uh, this is going to be available in March, April, we expect March, uh, depending okay. on location. Yeah. yeah. And worldwide? In uh, the US and in the European Union. Okay. Perfect. Canada? Ah, we'll get there. We'll get we'll there. We'll get sure. the Canadian. I'm going to buy it in the US and take it home. <laughs> we got to talk about this guy now. What sure. are we looking at? Yeah, this uh, we're looking at uh, an ECG device. When, uh, when you do an ECG, a uh, doctor uh, has to prepare your skin. Therefore, uh, usually uh, they apply patches uh, to you. They shave. You require shave. Uh, and they, and what, uh, is, what is that for? So I mean, it's to, it's it to capture, so they put in conductive gel on your skin mm -hmm. and that's to capture the small little signals that, that they are uh, in your body oh. and then be transferred into a, a device. So what we've developed is, uh, is a new technology that allows uh, people to uh, uh, have uh, the ECG without the need of uh, skin preparation. Okay. And uh, therefore, the, uh, uh, this is suitable for uh, uh, continuous uh, monitoring. So it's just as accurate as what I would get with them? Uh, yes. Wow. Yes. I can actually, I'm wearing it one right now. I don't know oh, if you guys okay. want to. Okay. Oh, wow. you're filming it. Yeah. I was going to not volunteer myself, but right. maybe somebody else to do a demo, but we're, we're, we're good here. My wife is very happy. I do this all the time. Yeah, I do, yeah. <laughs> So it, it looks hard. Can I feel it? Yeah, sure. So that's hooked up to an app then? Same app sure. or is it a different same app? app? Same app. Same I'll, app. I'll show so you so what it looks like. Interestingly enough, it has enough of a bend that it's a... Uh, that I can see that it's not too uncomfortable yeah. stand, you know, right there on you. 
Interesting. We, yeah, we put a lot, a lot of effort in the uh, design and the in the way that the device oh. has to bend. That's the many, many people have a different shape of a uh, right, uh, of chest. course. So, yeah, and therefore the bending was one of the most, the most important elements oh. in yeah. the design of the uh, uh, of the Quadio Four. Awesome. Now the and use so of this, sorry, you recommend just wearing it when you want to do the test, or would you wear it? Well, longer periods it's, of time. It's really designed to be used every day. So when you get dressed in the morning, you Ooh. just you know clip it on in two seconds and you're ready to go. You forget about it. So just like your fitness trackers, you absolutely, would stick your fitness absolutely. tracker on and you would stick absolutely. this on. Yes. So you'll just uh, you know wear it all day. Uh, okay. And uh, the uh, version that will be available in stores will be waterproof as well. So you'll be able to just keep it on all day. Okay. Wow. And what's the price point on this one? This will be available for four hundred and forty-nine dollars. Okay. okay, so that's a little more serious business, but that's a serious. Well, that's a serious test if you go to the doctor. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. It saves you a big a lot of hassle having right. that at home. Crazy. And we actually had a, a question from Xbox something user on uh, our chat room. I'm sorry, it's gone. But he was wondering, in terms of the battery life here, you said for about a year yep. with average use. What yes. is average use? Once so a day? We're, we're once, uh, once or twice a day. Once yeah. or twice a day. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. The Quadio Core instead works with a rechargeable battery, so it's okay. designed to be recharged once a day. Okay. And amazing. That's well, exciting stuff. Very exciting. Uh, obviously, health and wellness is a big um, conversation piece here at CES 2014. And so we appreciate you guys coming in to show us exactly how we can monitor ourselves, take care of ourselves, and be better, healthier people. Absolutely. I need this guy, because that's going to force me to eat healthy. OK. And, and, and then you can ride the bull next year. And I, I'll be a little bit, I'll look a good. little better on the mechanical you bull next great, year. You great, Kevin. <laughs> and you guys can go to getcartquardio.com yeah. uh, to check out more and see all of that. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys for having Thanks, Marco. Thank Thanks, Rosario. Thank you for joining us here in the chat room and on the live stream. Again, we're listening to you. Stay tuned for more great stuff coming right up. See us live. Keep watching. I'm Kevin. I'm Callie. Bye.